walk on that too. So you just walk by me and again with the hand signal. What? <laughs> That's why these people they're, they're they're so sick and then they have the black woman here in front of me staring at my face. Actually she just tried to she tried to cut in front of me and what they normally what they usually do. Alright, talked about that how they would engage in the sort of psychological manipulation so the dude walks by he does the whole you know making his hand like a V like I showed you guys and uh, she's standing there waiting right and then looking at my phone as she's trying to looking at me and then looking at my phone as she's trying to um, cut in front of me and that's why I as I said the word cut you know again it always yes yeah, no, there's another word like cut they'll use right um, cut cutting uh, dropped uh, what else uh, approve not approve this is all coming to shot to send me some little messages about a, about my disability right and trying to take my disability away because again I am exposing what it is that they're doing, the psychological operations, psychological warfare, the covert warfare, covert psychological warfare, as well as technology being illegally microchipped. Right? So, again, remember, if you look up what occurs in persuasion, it tells you that the architects of these programs, right, they try to escape accountability, right, by committing and getting others to commit atrocious crimes right and try to cover it up by labeling the victims as mentally ill or trying to create a mindset within the victim or victims of uh, being negative or create a negative mindset right and when I talk about the dark triads in high places the dark triads and the the predator department walking around with guns and badges right where you find the vast majority of serial killers pedophiles rapists domestic abusers right drug dealers you know they have outside of their realm they have to use certain people within the the public sphere again to try to create that mindset so therefore it takes the focus off of those and law enforcement or I should say the predator enforcement divisions or departments across America you know engage in these things so that the public won't look at them and what it is that they're doing while they're committing the very same crimes that they're arresting other people for a lot of these people have been manipulated brainwashed okay remember crime is a business Right? Crime is a business, and particularly in a capitalist country. Right? They must create crime. Right? They must create crime. Because it is a business. Crime helps to support various industries. Right? You guys need to understand what's truly going on. How they're creating these things because again, you know, it's part of the business. It's like psychiatry. So what do they do? They create the so-called uh, treatment in the form of pharmaceutical drugs, and they create within the society, right, the cause, right, in which people will have or uh, be labeled with mental illness. Okay, it's a racketeering scheme. Goes to the highest levels. All right, talk to you guys in the next video.